<clears throat> hey everybody, it's Clifton Clowers here with you, and uh, I want to thank everybody for tuning into this late night stream here of Clifton Farms, and uh, we're going to be uh, doing some late night streaming here, so we want to thank everybody for tuning in, that might be tuning in today, I do want to check our stream quality as we continue here our series on Ravenport. <clears throat> and of course it put me way up here because I didn't sleep. Well, that's just fine and dandy. So we are up in five, field five, doing that contract. My truck, I think, is at yeah. the shop. There's another truck at the farm. Well, <clears throat> it's one o'clock in the morning. We did finish the field of potatoes over there. Which is good. Um, so, we're actually gonna. I guess we'll go ahead and just skip over to the. There we go, to the truck. Good old truck. Can't go wrong. So, we're gonna head back to. Uh, Head back to the old farm here. Guess we need some lights. Otherwise, we can't see what we're doing. Oh, go, 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 go. This train, man, that train. That train will get you so fast. Okay, so we're going to head back up to the farm. which is close to field 17 and uh, if anybody's wondering uh, Leroy or Nate uh, is taking the night off today won't be joining us tonight I think it's a little too late for him oh look there's the train there's our farm on the other side of the tracks so let's figure out how we're gonna get over there real quick. Let's see what's on the other side of this building. Oh, there's the train tracks. We could just take the train. Oh, missed that. Dodge that like the matrix. Alright, so that's our field up here. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, we can go up to this spot up here, make a right. Yep. And this will take us around the fields, back down to 17, where we can uh, sleep through the rest of the night and continue our work on that contract as we get back. up north in the morning so let's pull in this truck this is actually uh, Nate's truck but you know he's not here we still look at this we're 7,000 in the hole we still need to fix our problems here on you know all the different Elevation issues like this stuff over here. Oh man, look at all this sweet grass. That's something that we could probably do in the meantime. Do we actually plow this stuff? No, this is all withered. That's right, it's soybeans and it's withered. It was worth a lot. It's withered. All right, 146. Let's get in here. And 146, almost two. So it's. Two, three, forty-six, 
four, five, six, seven, forty-six. That should be a good time to get started. Okay, yeah, nice and daylight, nice and bright. Still got my flashlight on overnight. Let's take technically our truck here. Oops. Do my straps. My old nineteen seventy eight. Hopefully, we're going to be able to get her to get up to the get up to the north where we need to be. So let's pull out our map here, and we need to get up to five so we can just go back out to the main road. We can make a left and then a right on the other side of the silo and take that dirt road all the way up. So. Main road left to the silo and then a right to the road. So that's what we'll go and do. What does this contract pay? 15 grand. So that'll get us back up to about seven or six thousand. So that's good to know. That's good. Maybe we can knock out another contract today if we finish this one out quick. And then we probably will be streaming for a little while. But, uh, I don't know, I, uh, I, I tend to play a little more realistic than Nate, which is, you know, fine. I actually enjoy having him in the game because he yeah, adds all kinds of fun. So uh, he will be missed tonight. As we, there's the east, what is it, the east silo, central grain silo, something like that. Right there. Here's the dirt road. This will take us all the way up. This is field nine, this big one. Off to the right, it's huge. It's the biggest field in the game. Or I should say it's the biggest field on this map. Not necessarily the game. We're gonna. Can't believe this old truck got up to 60 miles an hour. Okay, so now we're up past the field. We can go over the bridge. This rickety, unbe unbelievable bridge. Look at this thing. We gotta take it nice and slow over this bridge. Look at this, you can see through it. Alright, we made it. And that's the dirt road, but here's the main road. And that's field 5 right here. This is field 5. Let's find our equipment. There it is. Out in the middle of the road, or out in the middle of the field. You know, whatever. Well, let's try not to drive on the plowed ground. Look at that thing. We forgot even what we're doing. I guess we're cultivating. I don't remember which way I'm going. I usually like to split these up. So why don't we park our truck here? We'll get out, head over to our tractor. Let's see, so it's owned by Leo. Nothing, none of this has been touched. Do we just bring the tractor to the field? Is that all we did? Do we not do anything? Did we not do anything? to this field. <clears throat> it's cultivated. It. 
and you want us to sew canola. Field five, so I haven't done anything. It's just cultivated. Okay. It was John Deere. Eight R. Look how sweet this thing is. Look how nice and soft this chair looks. It looks like leather, but it's some sort of faux leather. Ah, oh, there's a nice little wrench in case I need it. Uh, radio. Looks like it's got some air vents up there for AC. It's got a control panel. <clears throat> Not quite sure what that is. That might open the back window. I don't know, but uh, let's fire on up. Nice and sweet. And uh, let's turn on our hazards because we're working in a different field. And what we'll do, did we, let's drive over here to see if, you know, maybe we plowed or cut this in half or something. No, it doesn't even look like we did that. Doesn't even look like we did that. Well, let's see. I guess we'll start down here. See, when you drive up the middle, it's not that. It's not that far. I think the easiest way to do this without worrying about trees. The only thing we'll have to worry about is that field over here. I think we'll be all right. Yeah, we'll have plenty of room to pick it up. So we'll start on this end. I can straighten this thing out. This is, this is a big old piece of equipment. I can't even imagine how wide this thing goes. So let's back her on up pretty good. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted at all. Back her on up some more. There we go. That should be good. Let's unfold it. Unfold it and see exactly. Look how cool this thing is. Wow. Holy cow. Okay, so we're not full on the fertilizer, but we are full on canola. And just to make sure. Canola. Field 5 with canola. So let's bring it over here. We'll get the edge. So and then we'll back her on up. Back this baby up. We'll let it overhang just a little bit like this so uh, we know we're getting the full edge of the field. All right, well, let's turn it on. It's not making too much noise. And let's uh, lower it. Okay, well, there you go. It's lowered. Here we go. Oh my goodness, we can barely pull this thing. Oh my goodness. We're pulling this at three miles an hour. 
Now five. Now six. Now we're catching up some momentum. The control panel doesn't look like it's saying much. We're about nine, ten kilometers an hour. You can see in the lower right hand corner of the control panel. Oh, a little off target. Let's get back on target. That's better. Ah, uh, we got this cool mirror set up, but the thing is so big you can't see around. There's a train again. This is the Stella. Stella. Okay, we're really getting off the rails here. Yeah, let's get this headland done and then come back and see where we stand. I think we'll be okay. I think our next pass is going to be probably a more straighter pass. Just to try to get the thing to look nice, you know. All right, so here's the end. Let's lift her on up. We're going to swing wide, sweet chariot. And this is as tight as we can turn. Yeah, it's pretty tight. All right, let's get back into business here. We're going to stay pretty close. Good. Uh, what does it look like? Okay, so we'll be driving our right wheel. Right, right wheel. Oh, my mouse. Uh, along the side of the finished part. To the right. Let's drop her down. Okay. And we're going to keep that already planted area right down the middle of our right wheel. Try to make a straight line out of that. I guess we'll kind of look a little bit further down, really, because now it's all over the place and this is... Yeah, we're doing all right on the straight line part. Kind of push it back to the right a little bit. Our straight line is looking good. Push it back to the right a little bit. Still on the target. Little bit off, but that's not bad at all. Okay, let's lift her on up. And what I would like to do, I'll go up a row, an approximate row. And I'm gonna follow, oh come on tractor. Come on, let's go. All right, I'm gonna follow these kind of lines. Kind of hard to see, but you can almost see them when you have the graphics turned all the way up. So I don't know. I'm gonna be going straight. I can kind of see it in this mode. Uh, let's drop her down, and we're gonna pull her straight as possible to cut this edge portion off and we'll take care of that. Two miles an hour. Holy cow. <laughs> it's unbelievable. Can't believe it's going so slow. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is going to take forever. Two miles an hour. We're not even kind of centered anymore. Oh, now all of a sudden we're going to hit three and out oh, back to two. Ah, 
free. We're really flying now. Look, we barely made it anywhere. That's funny. So, this is going to take forever. Um, I think what we're going to do is I will go ahead and cut this section off of the field and then plow the north side of it. Um, that should take a little bit of time and I'd like to see how much seed I have left after doing so. So uh, I'll go ahead and time lapse that. Keep in mind I'm going two miles an hour. Three now. Three to two miles an hour. Uh, so we'll see you on the other side of the time lapse. Okay, so we could kind of gear this thing off. No, that's that's too much. Uh, whatever. Let's get it off the train. We're gonna go back. Uh, let's lift her up out of the grass. We're gonna go back, get this little crevice. Maybe clean up the man for the field. I mean, technically, food will still grow there. It's not our field. You know, do we really need to clean it up? I mean, it's a nice thing to do, but if he was paying us, like, you know, 75 grand, that would be a different story, but.
This is about how much you have to veer off. No, no more than this, I would think. Because then you run the risk of getting caught in the ditch, or getting stuck in the mud. All that fun stuff. So, first I thought this would be a longer stream. I think I'm gonna end up cutting it short here once I get this last little sliver. Have just a, uh, just a little bit. I mean, I guess, well, it's about, uh, I don't know, three quarters of this field left uh, for some, a decent reward. Two miles an hour, boy. I, this this feel. I don't, I don't know. I might take this stuff back that I borrowed. Use my equipment, which is much lighter. Of course, it doesn't hold nearly as many seeds. Might be able to fix this part too, because I just made another one. It's good enough for me. Alright, alright, alright. There's one sliver. Oh, maybe not. Okay, well. I don't really call it an uh, evening for the stream. You can hear I'm pretty tired. So um, I will uh, go ahead and save the game here and then log out of the server. That way you can make us nice and fresh. And uh, yeah, I will probably be posting more content tomorrow, especially this video uploaded in full HD without the limitation of your bandwidth um, but I got a couple other things up my sleeve too that I'm uh, kind of testing with and uh, you know recording a little bit and thinking about sharing so stay tuned and make sure you hit the subscribe button on the home page and the bell notification icon that way you get notifications when I post a new video, because I'm going to be posting, oh boy, excuse me guys and girls, I'm going to be posting uh, videos of other games, things like StarCraft 2, uh, Lord of the Rings, probably online, uh, more of this game, probably some more Call of Duty, just because I haven't played in forever, um, and uh, I don't know, I got a couple other games, and I'm kind of keep them as a surprise so make sure you stay tuned hit that notification bell icon and subscribe to my channel that way you know when I post more gaming content other than that I would like to thank everybody who did stop into the, uh, into the stream tonight live and everybody else that ends up watching this back uh, I bid you guys all adieu and most importantly everybody be nice to each other. Have a good night.